We're going to discuss and show how we can accomplish the high shoulder ladder lift with this 24 foot ladder. As discussed in the article, this is a one firefighter task that, we can be, that, that can be accomplished by a pump operator, a driver, or one firefighter assigned uh, to this task. As you can see here with our truck in question, we have the ladder on the side of the, uh, of the fire truck. This also works well for uh, trucks that have ladder compartments where the ladder slides off the back. It works perfectly there as well. So in our case with this truck here with the ladder on the side, we have our 24 foot ladder with the middle of the ladder marked. You can use tape, you can use spray paint, you can put the number on the side of the unit like engine two, engine three, uh, truck one. That way identifies the ladder to where it belongs and also the middle of the ladder for, for balance and carrying purposes. The ladder is on the truck in terms of the bed section on the, on the uh, face out and I want to have the bed out. It works best for us in this situation with the one firefighter high shoulder carry to have the bed facing me when you see a little bit later on to raise it up against the building and to get the ladder in position raised uh, adequately. This is going to involve, it will involve rather the ladder to be on my shoulder with the beam of the ladder resting up here and holding it with my hand up on the rung. This will take a bit of balancing and some practice to get used to having this on your shoulder so you can e um, adequately easily uh, pull it off, walk to where you got to go for the ladder positioning and then set it and raise it and so on and so forth. So I'm going to go through how to do this. We'll put the ladder on my shoulder, we'll pull it off. I'll put it against this wall and raise it up, and I will talk through how we're doing that through each phase of the evolution. So right now the ladder's on my shoulder, and I have it balanced perfectly on my shoulder with my one hand holding my rung. This hand's free for carrying hand tools, or if I have no tools, I can hold the ladder as well for stability. I'm going to go towards my building now, the butt, or sorry, the bed towards me. I can now put the uh, butts of the ladder on the ground as I get to my positioning, and I can easily stand it up as such. Okay? Having the ladder balanced in the middle allows me to put the ladder up very easily on asphalt concrete. It's grass even easier. At this point, I can raise my ladder from the back because I have my halyard exposed to my, my front here. I can hold this ladder with my one hand on the beam and raise, or if I get used to the ladder being balanced on its own, I can have the ladder as such, and I can balance the ladder against my elbows and my left knee, and I can raise it up at this point in time. Now, the ladder goes against the building. I can get the angle set. And then rotate over or flip it over into proper orientation position. Okay, that's good. 